Hi, welcome back to Art by Brooke. So for today's art journal with me video, I decided to do a kind of a chatty voiceover and just kind of talk to you a little bit. I don't feel like I've gotten a lot of chance to do that and there's a lot to update you on. So the focus on this art journal page for this video was gratitude. I was kind of choosing that as a theme because of Thanksgiving and I'll probably actually post this video on Thanksgiving if I get the chance. And I think this was a very good theme to go with because for me this year, I have been both filled with gratitude at different times and also have kind of struggled with feeling thankful and kind of keeping positive in times of high stress and struggle and other things like that. So I wanted to kind of have a way to remind myself to keep it going. So one of the things I'm really grateful for is this year I actually started a new job and I work with some amazing people and do a lot of really cool creative things in kind of lots of different things on a daily basis. So I've really, really enjoyed that. I had needed a full-time job and it came at kind of the perfect time in my life. So I'm very grateful for that. Also this year, and I've kind of mentioned it here and there in a couple of my videos, um, my dad actually went into the hospital and he was there for a couple of weeks and there were a few pretty scary days. So for a couple of weeks, I pretty much spent all of my spare time after work at the hospital um, taking things to my parents and then also running home and taking care of things at home. So in all that time, I got really, really grateful for all of the nursing staff and the doctors that he had. There were some amazing people who only had his best interests at heart and did some incredible things for him and my mom and just our whole family. And ultimately, he's home and he's healthy. And I'm so thankful for everyone who worked to make that happen. Now, stepping aside from some of the gratitude talk, I'll come back to that, I promise. Um, this voiceover was actually really hard for me to bring myself to do. I have had a little bit of a stressful week, and I just kind of wanted to put it aside and not take the time to do it. And then, of course, I couldn't find my microphone, and I couldn't find the attachment for it. So I was like, you know what? It's just a sign. I shouldn't be doing this. And then I kind of sat for a little while and got frustrated with myself and I said, you know what, I just need to do this. So if any of you struggle with motivation, know that I fully understand and sometimes you can push through it, sometimes you can't. So just take the wins when you can. Kind of coming off of that thought, uh, one of the other things this year that I am grateful for is my family and friends and some of the people who work in healthcare who continue to help you try to find answers when nothing really makes sense and everything's a little bit scary. I've been exploring a lot of my own health issues lately and it's been kind of a couple year long thing and I still don't really have many answers, but starting to realize that I probably have some chronic type illnesses that will probably be there for a little while and there's not a lot to do other than lifestyle changes trying to eat healthier and certain vitamins and supplements and things like that. So it's been a very frustrating journey, but I have doctors who really validate me and a family who's super supportive. And again, I have my awesome job who's very understanding about appointments and also just a good place to go and kind of chat with people and be able to relax and be myself a little bit. On top of all that, I am so incredibly grateful for all of you here on YouTube. Basically, you're my YouTube family. And all of you who haven't given up on me when I've stopped uploading videos or haven't been able to upload as many or as often as I wanted to and just commented on everything and been so supportive. You're the reason that I am still working on these videos and still excited to try to put more out. So thank you so much.
Now, I haven't really talked about the video at all yet. And so, I mean, it's been pretty self-explanatory so far. I've been doing a lot of collage and, you know, I put down some color, which the paint actually was phthalo blue. All of my materials will be in the description below if I can think of exactly what I used. But um, phthalo blue is one of my favorite colors. And I put that down first with a dry brush and um, then collaged over it with a few things. And then I used a Sharpie pen to write out the quote. And the quote was just kind of a, a mantra that I have I was saying to myself. It's, I am grateful, I am grateful, I am grateful, and I will not let bitterness set in. I wanted to have that in my art journal as something I could look back on and think about and remind myself of because it's sometimes very hard not to be bitter, not to be angry, and um, just need to focus as much as I can on being grateful and positive. And I know that it's definitely not going to happen every day, but having kind of some of those reminders and things to trigger my memory will be really helpful in the long run. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about kind of the voiceover where I didn't really talk about the art as I made it. What do you prefer? Do you have a preference either way? And what would you like me to talk about next time if I do another one of these voiceovers? If you have any questions or topics you'd like me to discuss or talk about, please leave those in the comments down below and give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. And if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe and click the bell so that you get a notification every time I post a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day.